Have you ever heard about Europa? Not that Europa. This Europa. Let's take a step back to the year 1610 when the illustrious Galileo Galilei first pointed his telescope towards the heavens and discovered Europa, one of Jupiter's largest moons. This celestial body quickly piqued interest due to its icy surface, a stark contrast against the fiery visage of its parent planet. Galileo's discovery was monumental, not just in expanding our understanding of our solar system, but also in its implications for the possibility of life beyond Earth. You see, beneath Europa's icy facade lies a tantalizing secret. A vast ocean believed to be twice the volume of all Earth's seas combined. This discovery was a turning point, a beacon of hope in our quest to answer one of humanity's oldest questions. With the discovery of Europa, the question of life beyond Earth began to take a more concrete form. What makes Europa one of Jupiter's Galilean moons so captivating for scientists and space lovers? Let's explore the numerous facts about Europa to uncover its allure. Despite being the smallest of Jupiter's four Galilean moons, Europa presents a world of intrigue. Imagine a celestial body with a diameter of 3,100 kilometers, slightly smaller than Earth's moon. Fascinating, isn't it? Europa orbits Jupiter at an average distance of 671,000 kilometers and completes its orbit in a swift 3.5 Earth days. With an axial tilt of just 0.1 degrees, Europa experiences minimal seasonal changes. But Europa isn't just a cold, icy sphere in the vast darkness of space, its average surface temperature may plummet to a chilling minus 160 degrees Celsius, yet beneath its icy shell, there could be a vast ocean warmed by Jupiter's tidal forces. The magnetic field measurements taken by the Galileo spacecraft suggest a conducting material, possibly a salty ocean, beneath Europa's icy surface. This ocean could be twice the volume of all Earth's oceans combined. Now how far is this intriguing moon from us? On average Europa is approximately 628.3 million kilometers away from Earth. But don't let this vast distance dampen your curiosity. Europa's unique characteristics, including its potential ocean, make it an alluring subject in the ongoing search for extraterrestrial life. Its various geographical features such as the dark streaks called linea, add to its mystique. These streaks are believed to be cracks caused by Jupiter's tidal forces possibly allowing the ocean beneath to interact with the surface. As you can see, Europa is far from a frozen desert. It's a world full of possibilities and potential, a place within our solar system where life could exist. Thus, Europa, with its distinctive features and intriguing facts, presents a tantalizing possibility for the existence of extraterrestrial life. Could this icy moon really be a cradle for life? It's a question that has captivated scientists and space enthusiasts alike for years. The possibility of life on Jupiter's moon Europa is a fascinating concept that has been shaped by numerous scientific theories. One of the most compelling arguments for life on Europa is the existence of a subsurface ocean. You see, beneath its icy shell, Europa is believed to house a vast ocean, deeper than any we have on Earth. But we're not talking about a frigid, lifeless abyss. No, this is an ocean that could potentially be warm enough to support microbial life. So you might be wondering how could an ocean under an icy moon stay warm? The answer lies in a phenomenon known as tidal flexing. Europa orbits Jupiter in a slightly elliptical path causing it to be subject to intense gravitational forces. These forces stretch and squeeze Europa, generating internal heat through friction. This heat in turn could be enough to keep Europa's ocean in a liquid state and warm enough for life as we know it. But what kind of life could we expect to find? The most likely candidates are microbes, similar to bacteria found in some of Earth's most extreme environments. These tiny organisms could potentially survive in Europa's ocean, thriving in the dark, warm waters beneath the moon's icy surface. Of course, all these theories are based on our understanding of life as we know it here on Earth. Life on Europa, if it exists, could be completely different, challenging our very definition of what it means to be alive. While we have yet to find definitive proof, the clues we have suggest that life on Europa is a possibility worth exploring. The icy moon continues to beckon us with its mysteries and perhaps one day, we'll discover that we're not alone in the universe. Until then, Europa remains a tantalizing target in our search for extraterrestrial life. While we have yet to find definitive proof, the clues we have suggest that life on Europa is a possibility worth exploring. So what does the future hold for our exploration of Europa? Well, the future is looking quite exciting. NASA, in its relentless pursuit of knowledge and discovery, has planned a mission named Europa Clipper. 
This mission aims to conduct detailed reconnaissance of Europa's surface and subsurface to learn more about its ice shell and the subsurface ocean that lies beneath it. The Europa Clipper, armed with a suite of scientific instruments, is set to launch in the mid-2020s. But why Europa? What is it about this moon that has captured our curiosity and drives our exploration? Well, Europa holds a massive, salty, subsurface ocean beneath its icy shell. And where there's water, there's the potential for life. The Europa Clipper mission is designed to answer specific questions about Europa's ice shell and subsurface. The thickness of the ice, the depth of the ocean, its salinity, and its potential for harboring life. It aims to find more definitive evidence that could prove or disprove the existence of life on this intriguing moon. Moreover, the mission will also help us understand the habitability of other icy worlds in our solar system and beyond. It's not just about Europa but about understanding the broader universe and our place within it. This is all part of humanity's quest to answer one of the most profound questions. Are we alone in the universe? With each mission with each discovery we inch closer to an answer. The exploration of Europa is not just a journey to a distant moon, it's a journey into understanding ourselves and our place in the cosmos. In the grand scheme of things, we are just starting to scratch the surface. There is so much more to discover, so much more to learn. As we continue to explore Europa, we inch closer to answering the question, are we alone in the universe? If you liked the video, please consider to like and subscribe. Till the next cosmic adventure.